Hey guys, good morning. What is going on? This is your boy David Guy Kicks. Welcome to another David Guy Kicks vlog. If you guys haven't been following me, then you guys wouldn't have known where I am going right now. Right now we are on our way to Utah from California. It's about an 11 hour drive. Um, we rented this car and uh, we got stopped because our car is a front wheel drive. Since it's snowing up here, the roads are icy. We're gonna need chains to chain up the front wheels. But the thing is, since this is a rental, we're not allowed to do that. I just paid a hundred dollars for this. You're lying. No, I'm being serious. They wouldn't let us go through unless our tires were chained or unless we had an all-wheel drive because if you had an all-wheel drive, it would be a lot easier to drive. We're about three or four hours out. Ah! Is this Tahoe? But yeah, the reason we're going up to Utah is because we got some family up there and we're going to celebrate Thanksgiving. <laughs> Once they start chaining up the car, we're gonna go outside, we're gonna take you guys on a little snow adventure. I've only been to the snow about once or twice in my life, living in California. There's not a lot of places close to us that have snow. So yeah, we're gonna take advantage of this. Hey! I'm not trying to sink in. You know what would suck if I just sinked in right now? All right guys, we are outside right now. They're gonna chain up the car real quick. Oh man, I haven't been out snow like this in so long. It's been so long, man. It's been, I don't know how long, but I just, I love this. Look, I don't know if you can see it. Can you see that? All the snow's falling down. No, you can't see it? Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Athena's first time in the snow. Don't eat the yellow snow, Athena. Oh, shoot, my feet are cold. All right, so this is great. We ended up paying $65 for the chain, $30 for the installation, and they just took off the chain control, which means no one needs chains anymore. So we just kind of wasted $65, but hey, we might need them in Utah. So still, we kind of just wasted some time here, but I mean, it's all good. We gonna get there, we gonna get there, we gonna make it. You guys are gonna join me on this journey. Thank you so much. By the way, real quick, let me know what you guys think of my Tiffany Yeezys that I just painted. I uploaded the video and the first day, not even 24 hours, and it's already at 23,000 views. That is so crazy. That's the most views I've ever gotten in, in like 24 hours. So I am just so thankful, man. That's so awesome. Been giving me such good feedback and all this stuff. So let me know if you guys have seen that video. If you guys haven't seen that video, go check it out. I painted my Yeezy, my Beluga V2 Yeezys. A little orange stripe, oh I painted it Tiffany. It. Let me know. I'm so happy I brought this beanie, man. Ah, Target, it was like a dollar, like three dollars, right? H&M. H&M. Three dollars, three dollars and eighty cents. Three dollars and eighty cents at H&M. Yeah. My name is David. All right, thank you. All right, bye. Um, he will try to get in touch with Jose and he will, he's gonna call me. Does he have your number though? Yeah, he, he has my number. All right guys, so the craziest thing just happened. While we were at the gas station, I went into the bathroom and I see on the floor, there's this wallet full of 20s, full of ones. I'm not, I'm not joking. Look at all this. This is, there's over like a hundred dollars in here, okay? And I saw the guy who dropped the wallet go into the bathroom, but then he walked out and then I didn't see him anymore. I saw his face and I didn't see him anymore. So I went out looking for him, holding his wallet, but I think he left. So the only thing that we could find is his AAA card in here, which is like the roadside assistant. So I called them. Well, they're gonna contact Jose, get in touch with him. He's gonna call me and maybe we can meet up, give him his wallet back. He lives in Los Altos, which is only like 20 minutes away from Sunnyvale. So yeah, um, now we wait for the call. But where would we meet up? If we're already driving. The sugar bowl. Other than that, we are still on our way to Utah. It's gonna be a long ride. All right, so just a quick update. I'm still waiting for him to call me. He hasn't called me yet. But the thing is, 
Like this is the road, okay? I don't even know where the other road is, so it could be like on the other side. But what if, the thing is, we've been driving for like 10 minutes already, what if we've been driving like separate ways? I mean, worst comes to worst, when we get back home, I can always just send it back to him. Alright, another update. I know I probably shouldn't have done this, but I mean, I have the wallet and while I'm waiting for him to call, I decided to count the money. And there's about $400 in cash in here. Wow. I mean, worst comes to worst, I could just keep it because the YouTube checks ain't hidden like they're supposed to. Nah, I'm just kidding. I would never do that. Still waiting. Still waiting. It's been like 10 minutes since I last updated it. Hey guys, how's it going? So it is, uh, it's me, David Got Kicks. Um, I was driving and I just got pulled over. What's so funny? Something funny about that? Um, he has my ID right now, but he will be back in a bit to give it to me. But yeah, he caught me going 92 on a 75. I mean, it's my fault, I guess. Well, I mean, of course, it's not no one else's fault. Wow, this is my first ticket. Man, we, we were just been... Good thing I found that wallet, right? Just kidding. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. By the way, Don't speed quick, update, quick update about that. He hasn't replied to me. But worst comes to worst, I'll drop it off at his no, P.O. box it, it, because it, it, I have his address. Man. You're like, man. Try to make him laugh. No, they already did it. They already gave you the ticket. There would be no point. I, I will give you a freaking 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm being serious, I'll give you the $50 if you do it. If you make him laugh like that. No. Here's Brian, so. Yes, sir. Here's your my driver's license back. Thank you. So I did cite you for the speed today. Mm. The information about your citations right here. Do you take care of Lake Township Justice Court out of Lovelock, Nevada? On or before January 31st, 2017. You okay. get three officers to take care of it right here in the back, which include mail on it in. Alright. You can also call that phone number on the front and see if you can take care of everything over the phone if you'd like. Alright. I do need you to sign this. It's not a mission of guilt, just let the court know you'll take care of it. Yeah. Okay. Can I do this? Any questions? Uh, no. Alright, you guys drive safe, okay? Thank you. Thank you. See, they just got another one on the other side. They got, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they, they like... They stand, I'm they telling you, I should have... That's why I kept repeating, love lock, love lock. So we're in the... We have cops going on that side. We're in the city of love lock right now. Um, there was another cop on a bridge, and then there's another cop down on the other side of the bridge. Just like he was talking on him, talking to him on the microphone, and Snitch. he caught me. Oh well, there's this is back. my first speeding ticket. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go on your record. You guys, wait, you guys just um. Are you sure it's going now? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! For the next three years <laughs> until it falls off. Look, look, look! They just caught another one. I'm gonna film this right here. You ready? Hold on. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> This trip is very interesting. This is my first ticket. I don't even know what to say, what to do. Thanks for thanks for being there for me, guys, though. I'm glad I can talk to you guys and vent on this camera. Uh, we're about four hours away now, which isn't too bad compared to 11 hours from our house. But we had to stop by Jack in the Box. It's cold out here. It's so cold. I don't even know where we are. I think this is like Winna, Winnemucca. Something like that. We're in Winnemucca. There's something I've always wanted to do. I've always wanted to do like a, a taco eating challenge with my brother. So comment down below, like like right now. Pause this video, I will have a little intermission. Let me know if my brother and I should do like a taco eating contest. Cause I feel like I can eat a lot. I feel like I can eat more than him. Huh. But you know, something funny? That's what I thought. But yeah, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want to see that on my vlogging channel. I will upload a video. I'm freezing. I'm freezing. When you get barbecue sauce on your new NMDs, it was worth it. It was worth it, you say? Yeah. Alright, so we made it to Utah. You guys can kind of see me. You guys kind of can't. It's all good. If we are in Harriman right now, about 15 minutes from South Jordan, that's where we will be staying for the weekend. Alright guys, so we made it safe to Utah. Now we're gonna hit up Leatherbees. Leatherbees is like a... I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but we're here. We're gonna hit it up. And um, we, we met up with some family. We got home, we dropped off all our stuff, and now we're gonna eat leather bees. This is in daybreak, I believe. So they're open until 11. Oh, we're about to go in. In. Instagram. So let me tell you something. Yes. Let me tell you something. I brought Let's some eat. New York steak. New York steak? You already know we had to hit up that dessert. <laughs> Right. No, you can 
All right, guys, so we're finally here back at the house. I'll catch you guys next time. Really hope you guys enjoyed today. Take care. See you tomorrow. Day one in Utah. Happy Thanksgiving. You guys are going to watch us on Thanksgiving. Oh, wow. You guys are going to watch us on Thanksgiving. What a great way to spend your Thanksgiving, huh? I'll catch you guys next time with another vlog tomorrow. Bye.